Hi everyone, we're Pop Couple. I'm James. Lisa. And we're here to do a box. It's a mystery box. It's a mystery box from Castletown Collectibles. Mm -hmm. um, some of you may have heard me talk about it during a live mm -hmm. um, that we uh, were Contacted. gonna be working with uh, Castletown Collectibles. Um, there's gonna be a Pop Couple code and everything like that. Uh, unfortunately for right now, um, he has to step away for a little bit. His hope is to come back. Yeah. So, um, but he did send this box uh, to us. Uh, we we're gonna be working on mystery boxes with him and um, all kinds of other, well, hopefully all kinds of other stuff. So again, we're hoping that, that uh, they'd emailed us, said that they were still gonna send a, a box to yeah. us. And so we'll see. Um, I mean, we're excited. We have no idea. No clue. Um, what could be in here. I don't know. But um, we'll find out. Uh, I know that they had asked, you know, things that we collect, we like. Right. Um, things and, we were looking for. And we let them know. Uh, so. We shall see. Yeah. So, here we go. So it looks like we've got three. Sorter boxes. Sorter boxes. So. So bubbles. Sorter box one. There's no numbers. Sorter box two. Oh, and a note. Awesome. 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 And sort of box three. There we go. All right. Get the box out of the way. So it's Castletown Collectibles. And it says, Dear Pop Couple, thank you for creating quality content for the Funko community and collectors in general. It's under unfortunate circumstances that Castletown Collectibles will be temporarily closing. However, I would like this package to serve as an introductory gift and also as a parting gift. <laughs> Hopefully in the future I will be able to reopen. Thanks again, sincerely, Tyler from Castletown Collectibles. So, um, so I know they do have an IG where previously they were posting things right. that you could pre-order, you could order from them. Uh, they do have a website, so we will link all that information down below. Yes. So we're, ho we're hoping to that uh, they, they come, come back. back. Yeah. So, um, anyway, like we said, we've got three boxes, sort of boxes. here. Um, Randomly pick one? Sure. Do you want to go first? Go for it. Okay. Uh, I'll, I'll just pick one closest to me. So. Uh, and these are the fun sort of boxes to get open. You can't really open. But that's good because it has them nice and sealed and yeah. they're protected nicely. So, okay. Um, some foam wrapping also on mm -hmm. it to help protect it. Oh. So there's a certificate, there's a certificate on the back. This one. So this is oh very cool. Oh. Um this is Agent J and Frank. So what's funny is we actually I... just pulled Agent J from a different yes. mystery box. Um and Lisa had commented that oh it'd be cool if we got the this one, one with the little pop. Right. Uh there we go. So yeah. there and we it go. Has and it's signed by and Will Smith. Pop shield protectors. <coughs> All right, so there's a certificate of authenticity. of authenticity. Will Smith autographed Funko Pop hologram something. Joseph Werther's handwriting expert. Interesting. Very cool. Yes. So awesome. So we don't see that too often. No. Um, it's been a while since we've gotten an autographed pop. I think the last one was from. Um, Oh, I store. think it was a big pop shop. Big pop shop uh, mystery box. It was a box. signed uh, Jason. Jason. So, so yeah, so this is, that is cool. a signed Agent J. So that is very cool. Um, that we will add cool. that into our autograph pops. Yeah, which we, have, like, we two don't of have now. very many. Um, so that's cool. We'll probably get some more signed sooner than later. But, we hope. But yeah, but that Autographs is awesome. Autographs tend to be pricey though. That's the hard part. Yes. When you go to cons and you go to get signed things and people want... 60 to 200 dollars for their autograph and it's like Ooh, i don't know if i want to pay that much right so so but that right. is awesome I, I'm, I'm, I like it i'm excited actually box number two we've done the middle <laughs> if it wants to <laughs> so more foamy and i see a shared sdcc Ooh. sticker so this is two cans cool we do not have this either no we missed out on this one so i could not get into the funko booth that had these when i was at the con so this is the san diego comic-con 2019 toucan ad icon which is cool because we did not and could not get our hands on this one no we didn't get it from the funko shop either mm -mm. 
So that's cool. I didn't realize it was an ad icon though. Yeah, because it's the San Diego. I mean, icon. I, I get that now, but like yeah. I didn't think of it as like the cereal ones oh, or stuff yeah, yeah. like that. So very nice. Thank you yes. very much. There is one more box I will pass to you. Alrighty. Because it's Yo turn. My turn. Oh. So uh, this is a cool one. Definitely yeah. one that we would be collecting. And I know that we had no luck in seeing no. it anywhere. I have um, not seen this one. This is, yeah, this is a cool, cool one. So this is a exclusive to a certain place where we've never had any luck. No. So it is the Foot Locker Disappearing Miles Morales. So this is very cool. We do- Collect Spider-Man. Spider-Man, yeah. And it's one of those, it's weird because we're not huge Spider-Man fans. No. We just love the pops. Yeah. They, the, I think they do a really good job with a majority, <laughs> a majority <laughs> of the Spider-Man pops. Yes, they do. So this is very cool. I like I, I'm one. excited. This is cool. So it isn't that one that collection? Okay, so it's we the have Spider Verse. So we have that Miles Morales. Uh, I don't know about anybody else. We have Prowler. Oh, we have Prowler. Yeah, but nobody else. Prowler. I know I passed on Green Goblin because it's yes. like ten inch. <laughs> anyway, so um. Very cool pops. Yeah. So thank you, Castle Town Collectibles. Very much. We really appreciate this. Um, and again, like we said, we hope that you can you'll, you'll be back for sure. Uh, so, but uh, let's give you a closer look at these pops before we get too much further into it. Ready? So, spinnies. There you go, closer look at the, at the three pops that we got from Castletown Collectibles. Um, again, we were excited to to enter into a little bit of a, a, a and we've got partnership with them. So, uh, like we said, we hope that they are able to come back. For sure. Um, so, but uh, I would say, you know, we'll put, like we said, we'll put the information down below, their IG and everything. Follow them. Um, that way you know when they come back and you can uh, check them out. Yeah. So um, in the comments below, let us know what do you think of this mystery box. Mm -hmm. um, like I said, I, I, I like all of it. I'm I excited. Um, one of those, never thought I'd ever have a pop signed by Will Smith. I uh, Number either. one. Um, and it meets the uh, little pop guys that yeah. this one likes. Um, we did... I mean, I liked the toucan. Lisa was a little meh about the toucan. Yeah, but I, bet I couldn't get it anyway. But I think so. it's a cool pop. Yeah. And then this one is definitely cool. Yeah, that the fits display. our Marvel Spider-Man collection. Yes. So, so um, but yeah, so let us know in the comments below what do you guys think of these. Um, yeah, let us know. And maybe drop Castle Town Collectibles a message and just say- Or a follow on Instagram. Or follow on Instagram and just say, hope you come back soon. Right. So anyway, other than that, as always, if you enjoy our videos and you like hanging out with us, please subscribe, hit that like button, and we'll see you next time. Bye. Bye.